What we try to do is create um, resource information for the creative community who then can use that resource information in their programming that they're creating that will then reach millions of people. So it's almost like you're educating the creative departments of all of these uh, shows or uh, primetime uh, productions. Right. It's actually there's three elements of it. Uh, one of them is education, okay, which is getting them to recognize that there's a certain topic that they might want to pay attention to. The second element are, is the resources that we give them, which means collecting the best data and information to help them be educated about it. And many times that can be showing them both sides of the coin. You know, well, there's a, usually a re like a research, you know, every researcher you can find that says something happened that went this way, you can probably find research that said something went the other yeah. way. So we try to be, we try to be able to, to, to package the resource information so they can understand the full debate and the, few, the issue in its fullness. And then the third, which is our, uh, is recognition. And this is basically a job well done. Uh, so, and, and that's measured based on entertainment value in terms of what they do, uh, but also in terms of content, how accurate, you know, the key word there is accuracy of depiction. And so education resources and recognition are the three elements. And then that manifests itself in terms of the mental health area, for example, uh, in a television special that we do called the Prism Awards. But it's not based about the, it, it wasn't a TV special to start with. It was actually uh, a recognition activity for the writers and producers and directors who accurately addressed mental health and addiction issues within their programming. Okay.